Tire alert, tire alert, tire alert. So we have a tire video going on today, obviously, and but we got some news and I wanna let you guys know. Toyo is jacking up their prices 8.5% due to the current state of the world. August 1st, 2021 is when this is gonna happen. So if you're looking at some like Extensa HP2s or our triple eights, if you're super fancy, now is the time to get them before August 1st, 2021, because again, there's gonna be that 8.5% tire price increase on Toyo tires. You're probably gonna see this from other manufacturers down the road because it's just getting harder and harder to get material. Enjoy the rest of the video. I'm back, baby. It's been a minute since I've done a video like this, but guess what? This is going to be the best video you've ever watched because we're talking about affordable rubber. Okay, okay, I know. Not the most exciting thing ever, but this is important. I feel like buying tires is similar to mowing your lawn, you know, like you put it off longer than you should. You don't necessarily want to do it. But when you do it, you stand back, look at what you've done, and you're like, thank God that's over. And you're proud of yourself because you did the one adult thing that you had to do for the week, and that's it, you're ready to go. But all right, that's enough of the stories and enough of the lawn mowing. Let's get into what's going to replace the Federal 595s and Nitto Neogens that have no chance of being in stock anytime soon. And then obviously you can get any tire mentioned in this video over at the best car part site in the world, fitmentindustries.com. You're gonna actually save some money by picking up tires with your new set of wheels, and we will mount, balance, and ship them for free to the lower 48. Stretchy boys, meaty boys, we will mount anything. Anything! First up on the list, we have the Vercelli Strata 2. Now, when I go over prices, I'm going to be using the sizes 225, 40, 18 for all of them, just to be consistent, so know that they might vary a little bit for the sizes you specifically need, and prices can change, but this is at the time of recording and should give you a good idea. The Strata 2s are an all season that's going to come in at $357 for a set of four. That's cheap, baby. That's the type of price where you can do a couple burnouts and not feel that bad about it. Other than that, what you're looking at is an A traction rating. If you don't know what traction ratings are for tires, it's pretty simple. Double A is the best, then A, B, and C being the worst. Not really sure why they had to go with the double A and get away from the traditional A, B, C, D, F rating I grew up with, but I don't make the tires I just drive on them. So the Strata 2 has a pretty solid traction rating paired with its 500 tread wear rating. This tire is going to last a little bit too. On top of all that, you're going to get a 45,000 mile limited protection policy. Next up, we have the Delente D7 Thunder. These are even slightly more affordable than the Stratas coming in at $335 for a set. So this is an all season again, and the traction rating is an A. The tread wear rating comes in at a 420 for the memes and the jokes. So this tire has a little less tread life than the Vercelli, but it's still pretty high <laughs> because for... <laughs> This tire has wide grooves which help with channeling water so you don't hydroplane and also helps minimize road noise. You're also going to see a 40,000 mile warranty on this puppy. Delente says, a luxury feel with ultra high performance engineering giving you the edge. So if you want the edge, maybe this is the tire for you. Next! So what we have now is a tire that just rolls off the tongue. The Lexani LXUHP-207. So now we're dabbling out of all this all season talk and getting into an ultra high performance tire. Basically don't slap these on your 350Z and expect to drive through a blizzard to get to Walmart because you dropped your Xbox controller and now your mic won't work so you have to go get a new one. These won't get you there. But these are great for the summer or driving anywhere that it doesn't get negative 30 degrees outside. These are slightly more expensive than the Thunder and the Strata coming in at $408 for a set, which still isn't bad at all. It's super cheap, especially for a performance tire. You're going to see an A traction rating and a 500 tread wear rating and to follow suit with the rest of the tires it's going to have that 40,000 mile warranty. This tire has a specific V-shaped tread pattern that help with higher speeds and also braking. Not too shabby. To wrap this up we have the Continental Extreme Contact DWS06 Plus. Now this tire is going to be a little more higher end compared to the other tires mentioned in this video, but I wanted to give the option for the people looking to bool out a little and give your car that nice gift it deserves. These are an all season performance tire coming in at $803 for a set. Whoa, 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 I know, I know, hear me out. That's really not a bad price at all for quality like this. Coming with the only AA traction rating on this list and a 560 tread wear rating, that's some of the best numbers and letters we've seen so far in this video. Not sold yet, how about that 50,000 mile warranty? That's hot. 
that gets me going. Not to mention it has this neat little feature with quick view indicators. These are built into the tread and allow you to see exactly where the tire life is and lets you know the performance that's left in them simply just by eyeing up the tread. This tire is great for almost every condition and is going to have really decent tread life. But what do you guys think? Is there a tire I missed out on and you guys wanna yell at me about it in the comments? Drop it down below. I try to read every single one. Don't forget to check out the links in the description to take a peek at all the tires over at fitmentindustries.com. And then remember, if you pair them with some wheels, you'll save some money. We'll mount, balance, and ship them for free to the lower 48. It saves so much hassle from going to the tire shop, trying to fit all your wheels and tires in the back of your two-door car. And then not to mention, we have other car enthusiasts mounting them. So they're going to take care of them. Make sure there's no dents, scratches, any of that bullshit from those other shops. But yeah, that's all I got.